Hey guys, welcome back to the channel again. And today I'm making this video to show you something that was happening for <laughs> many days. So I noticed it just yesterday, and I thought of doing some changes, and that I'm gonna show you. You guys see that the tank is missing someone. If you guys can identify that, you guys can comment it down. But I am telling you that the Gurami is not present over here. You guys can see nowhere. Actually, the main reason I separated him because he was fighting with the Arwana. When I separated her and him into a breeding tank, they were good means they were uh, happy over there. But this guy was facing way too many problems because the Guramin was constantly tearing down his tails. Okay, you guys can see, yeah, tails. So I thought of removing the Gurami and adding the Oscar pair over here. But there is a problem that was coming and that is they were kept there to lay their eggs. But in this tank it's impossible for them to lay their eggs because Arwana is here and that Pleco is over here. And for that reason uh, I was not taking them inside this tank. But I thought that Arwana is never going to eat their eggs, those small things that if they lay their eggs over here in this plate or in this marble, Arwana is never going to eat that. And if this guy tries to go there, he will be brutally attacked. So this tank is uh, a good place for them to lay eggs and they can lay eggs because it's way too big. You guys can see, it's way too big. And the arowana is roaming on the uh, right hand side and not goes up to here and I had put one wood over here so that the arowana is not coming in that corner and they can be laying their eggs properly and for that reason I separated the gurami in a single tank single um, different tank where he was she so not he but she is happy and everyone is happy over here see they are, I mean, they are sitting over here and maybe laying the eggs on this marble because they find a uh, plain surface to lay the eggs so guys this was the information that I wanted to share and you guys can comment it down below that I took a good decision or not because the Gurami was constantly attacking the Arwana and I couldn't see that because I love this guy a lot, it's way too much. If one scratch in his body, it hurts me over here. So for that reason, I separated the Gurami. Yeah, I love Gurami also, but the affection for him is way too higher than the others. Means I don't love them that much as I love him. So this is the update. And thank you for watching the video. Goodbye for today. Bye.